earlier on today that I was uh, asked to attend a Christian event, a 10th anniversary of Christian Concern, a group of, of, of lawyers that defend the freedom of speech and Christian rights of freedom of speech. So they asked me to attend the 10th uh, anniversary of their uh, organization and I did it. They paid you know, for my travel and my hotel fee, brilliant. Andrea, actually the founder, uh, has endorsed my book. Her name is on there. Well, 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 well. Who are willing to stand up and defend the British white people to defend their culture. And all I ask you is to support me. For the past 28 years, I have lived amongst the white communities under the radar. It is only now, five years ago, that I have decided to speak out and defend the British white people and their culture. Support us, please. Support us. One of the ways you can support me is to buy this damn book. It's on Amazon. And how Tommy was treated and uh, labelled a far-right racist by the media and politician. It is then I decided to come out in his defence, speaking on public platforms with him. They have gone against the will of the British people by allowing single young men into our country without proper checks, putting our women and children in harm's way by allowing more rape culture into our country. Putting our women and children in harm's way by allowing more rape culture into our country. This Tommy Moran is so busy reading from his script that he forgets he's being bigoted towards refugees by demonizing them as having a rape culture. This guy is willing to repeat racist talking points from the far right as a token ethnic man in order to receive the odd handout and to sell a bit of merchandise. Some folks sell their dignity cheaply. We must not allow ourselves to enter the arena of hate or our argument will become weak and void. Mark my words, right? If my Pakistani communities don't get their house in order, they're going to suffer the consequences of their actions. Because at the moment, the British white people have been a tolerant people, patient. Imagine if the English raped girls from our communities, the Pakistani communities. You would have been straight onto the streets, rioting, burning cars. This is, this is your animal instinct. Yet the British white people are a tolerant people. They got patience. They are civilized. Pathetic and your accent, man. I can't stand that accent. I I hate the Pakistani Asian accent, and I'm glad that I don't even have it. Okay, so I wanted to make this quick video about Tommy Robinson right now. Everybody's making videos about him, you know, saying that, oh, you know, he's a victim. You know, I want to make this video about a Tommy Robinson. This, oh, bloody, bloody, you bloody fools, you Pakistani Muslim bloody fools. Pathetic and um, your accent, man, I can't stand that accent. I, I hate the Pakistani Asian accent and I'm glad that I don't even have it. You pathetic creature. With our, with our Pakistani community with that backward mentality with